What's up guys? In the last tutorial we studied about about for loop that is an iterative statement. Uh, there's another kind of an iterative statement uh, while or the while loop. Okay. Uh, all the things that you can do using a for loop that can be done using a while loop and vice versa. Uh, this basic syntax is while in bracket you have a condition. and then you have statements inside curly braces okay uh, suppose uh, I want to print numbers from 1 to 100 so firstly I'll define a variable suppose I and it will be equal to 1 so then I'll put this while i is less than equal to 100 and print i and then I'll increment the value of i after printing I'll write i++ plus plus. so how does this while loop actually works this condition or till, till the time this condition is true the while loop will execute as soon as it becomes false the statement inside the while loop won't be executed and the next line would be executed after the while loop here okay so uh, in this example the first first i would be equal to 1 it would print i then i would increment 2 3 4 5 then it would be 100 it would print 100 when it becomes 101 so it would check here is 101 less than or equal to 100 so it would evaluate as false false so it won't execute the while loop then it would come out so let's try this out in our code I'll use the same example that I used for for loop. I want to print all the even numbers from 1 to 20. So print even numbers from 1 to 20. Okay, this time we'll use uh, we'll write a program using a while loop. I'll just save this file first. I'll give it a name while. Okay, I'll write my basic structure first. Hash include stdio.h int main and return 0. Okay, first I'll define a variable i. Int i is equal to 1. So, what's the condition here? While i is less than equal to 20 okay so we want to print only even numbers so i'll check that if y is even so how would i is even i so i'll check this way if i modulus 2 if we divide i by 2 and we get a remainder of 0 that means the number is even so if i mod 2 is equal to equal to 0 i'll print I'll print i and I'll have a backslash and for new line okay then I I'll increment the value of i as in i plus plus I'll execute my file compile and run okay yeah it's giving me two four six eight till twenty okay uh, after coming out of the loop I'll print the value of i again here I'll write a printf statement and it would say after completion of while i is equal to I'll put here percentage d comma i so, okay yeah let's execute our file and see I'll have compile and run okay yeah we are getting all the even numbers first 2 4 6 8 20 and after completion of while i is equal to 20 21 uh, what does that mean at this point i has become 21 
so how is this working i is incrementing by 1 1 1 1 and then 1 2 3 4 till 20 then it became 21 it checked the condition is 21 less than or equal to 20 it said it's false so it broke this part it left this part and came here at this point i becomes 21 uh, also yeah uh, suppose i want an infinite loop as in i want uh, while to run infinite number of times so i can write here while one or any non-zero number as in a non-zero number represents true so i can write here any non-zero number okay the next kind of iterative statement is the do while loop okay do while loop uh, so what's the syntax for that do then you have a number of statements here statements and here you write while in the bracket you have condition uh, so it as soon as this condition becomes false uh, the loop is not executed so you might be thinking what's the difference between a while and a do while loop why do we need a do while loop okay uh, in do while loop the st all the statements are executed at least once in while loop the f first the condition is checked and then the statements are executed in do while loop uh, for th when th when it runs for the first time the statements are executed then the condition is checked so the loop runs for at least one times even if the condition is false uh, okay let's try this out in a code we'll write the same program using a do while loop okay uh, i'll remove this part control x okay i'll write here do print this part these braces are not required okay so do these statements and while uh, let's execute a file compile or not okay it's producing the same output okay as i said that do while loop uh, runs for at least one time uh, so let's put i is equal to 100 we know that i is less than or equal to 20 is the condition so this condition is false so it must run for one time uh, so let's see compile and run yes this code is running for one time as in the loop so that's the basic difference between while and do while loop okay yeah that's it for this tutorial see you in the next one please do subscribe to our channel like our video and do provide your suggestions for our improvement thank you